Всем привет, my name is Vika, I'm very glad to see you on my channel and as some of you may notice, I'm not filming in our like usual location, we are uh, in a trip and uh, today I wanted to talk with you about what we take with us in a trip as a family of three, we have a toddler and uh, we usually pack very light, uh, so for example, this backpack and these couple things are everything that we take with us for our trips and when i say everything i mean everything we don't have a car so this is like literally everything that is with us we usually travel using public transport like buses or trains or we can get a taxi or you know just public transport and things like that so yeah i'm going to show you everything that we took with us for this specific trip and this trip it was a surprise for me from my husband because yesterday was my birthday. Uh, <laughs> yes, I'm going to film a vlog from this trip and from the birthday itself, but I still wanted you to know that it was my birthday yesterday. I turned 23. So let me show you everything that we take with us. And guys, I'm not, you know, I'm not judging anybody who's packing massively for uh, their own trips. Everybody's different, everybody has different needs. And if you need this thing, these things, if you want to take them with you, then fine, do that. I just wanted to share how we pack uh, because I think it may inspire some of you to pack lighter. Maybe there will be some tips that you'll find helpful for packing and you know just wanted to share how we pack in case you're interested so let's just go right into it. We just try to find the balance between having everything that we need and everything that would make our trip more comfortable even if we don't really need that and you know not taking too much stuff because we basically have to carry everything on our backs. So first of all, uh, it's our Ergo Baby backpack. Uh, we take it instead of stroller, Agatha is not a big fan of strollers and strollers are very uncomfortable for public transport. So we just carry Agatha everywhere in it. So this pack of diapers, let's talk about it first. These take half of the amount of the backpack and we do not use cloth diapers during trips. It's very uncomfortable. They take a lot of space. You need to wash them all the time. So I'm just using disposable ones only for like comfort. Uh, and if we go for about a week or so, we usually don't take them with us because they would take all the space in the backpack. Usually take just a little bit for one day and then we buy a small pack of diapers in the place that we come to. Uh, but if we go to like this trip, we went for four days. So we decided that it would be easier for us to take all the diapers with us. And it was about half of our stuff in the backpack or a little bit more than half and the other part were just diapers. <laughs> Next, let's talk about shoes. Uh, we don't usually take any extra pairs of shoes with us because they take so much space. And I honestly don't need like any extra shoes, I can wear one pair of shoes for like the whole week. So basically we don't pack them because we are wearing them all the time. I usually uh, choose the pair that would be very versatile when it comes to weather, that I know would not make my feet hurt after a long uh, time of walking. So this time I took these sneakers, I was just wearing them. Uh, they go with the dress, they go with uh, shorts, I didn't take any pants with me, so they would go with pants anyway. They are fine for hot weather, for colder weather, so just... We took sneakers for Agatha and sandals, like two pairs, just, you know, kids can um, get into something wet or dirty, just in case. One of them she was wearing and the other one it doesn't take much space. My husband is also wearing uh, sneakers and a t-shirt with shorts. Let's talk about clothes next. Um, these are all the clothes, um, except for the ones my husband is wearing and this dress. Um, Agatha is sleeping in a diaper, so <laughs> yeah, these are all the clothes. My husband usually takes more clothes than I do because I'm okay with washing my clothes during the trip. For example, if I run out of underwear or if I feel like I need to wash a t-shirt, uh, I am okay with washing it with the soap in the sink or 
Sometimes uh, if we rent apartments, we can even use the washing machine. My husband doesn't like to do that, so he usually takes the exact amount of t-shirts, socks and underwear that he needs without washing. Uh, I took two t-shirts with me uh, for wearing outside uh, with these shorts and I took this set for wearing at home and for sleeping also. This is a t-shirt and uh, shorts. I sometimes take a silk combination of top and the bottom for sleeping, but it also takes like this amount of space. So this is everything I need for four days uh, with my sneakers, this dress also, and if I need, I can just wash them in a sink and they would dry overnight and I'll be just completely fine with that. Next are my husband's clothes. So he took one, two, three, four t-shirts with him plus one he's wearing. So he uses one of them for wearing at home also and others for wearing outside. And he took shorts for home and shorts that he's wearing outside. Agatha's clothes have a little bit more <laughs> varieties of style. So uh, we took two t-shirts for her, um, one for wearing at home, uh, one for wearing outside, but we also can use it for home wear if we want to. Two dresses, it's very hot here, uh, it's going to be 25, 28 uh, degrees Celsius uh, for all the four days. Pants and the sweater in case if it would get colder, but I think it would not. A big pack of underwear, socks and other stuff. I'm not going to go through that. These are all the clothes that we took. And here are our documents, everything that we need, like passports, uh, documents for Agatha, uh, for just in case, you know, all the documents. Um, then bottle of water, we take it with us and we usually pack everything that we don't need in the road into the backpack like clothes, diapers and other stuff if the road is short and everything that we might need in the road we put in my shopper bag so we can easily like take it and we won't have to go through the whole backpack for you know finding something so we usually take water and we put it in our shopper bag we take um, like books and toys for Agatha, we take snacks. I don't have any snacks here because we ate everything during the trip. Here is not my uh, tripod, I think it's called like that, you know, that thing for filming, for holding a camera, uh, because we didn't took it here, but sometimes we take it and I would put it in my shopper bag too. And also you can see my thing for stabilization. It is not very big, but still I put it here, as well as my phone and keys and other stuff. Here are all the chargers that we need. Oh, and also I forgot to mention that we have our iPad with us. Uh, it's in Agatha's room, it's making some noises for Agatha to sleep uh, better while I'm talking here because I'm talking quite loudly here and we very often use it, you know, this sound. It's, it's like a sound machine but it's just our iPad. But in the past, before I started the YouTube channel, we, would, we didn't have a computer with us because we didn't have any laptop and we didn't have any tripod or the stabilization thing so it took even less space for us. Now we have to take a little bit more digital stuff. We used to just take our iPad and just our phones with us. Then my computer for work, for watching movies in the evening. <laughs> Two toys for Agatha and you may say that it's quite a small amount. She is not interested in toys almost at all. Like I took this just in case she would want to play with them. And these are the ones that she sometimes plays with at home but she's not interested at all here. She's very interested in books, so I buy uh, quite a lot of them. We just took some of them with us. She just wants to do everything with a book. She eats with books, she uh, cuddles with me with books, <laughs> she brushes her teeth with books, and just all the time she brings a book to me and she wants to just see it and she wants me to read it, to go through pictures. Uh, we also use them to entertain her during uh, the road. We don't show any cartoons to her. 
just because I don't think it's necessary. We have three big ones. Uh, this it was a new one. We used it uh, in a road because you know like new book can entertain better it was a set just three of them like that and sometimes my husband takes them uh, when he goes to walk with her outside uh, for the playground and you know other places uh, you can see that i took a book with me too i usually don't take any physical books with me for trips because they take space and i'm not always have time to read them so I usually read digital ones in trips, but this time I really wanted to take this one. And the last, but I think also very interesting one. This is a little bag for, you know, everything for the bathroom. I have a um, hairbrush, we have two, it's a little bit messy here, blades. Like blade is the thing that goes inside, but razors, razors, so we have two razors. We have a, like a little set for um, nails, hair ties. That's what goes into this pocket because it's just, you know, more sharp instruments. So I just put it here. Then you can see that it's a little bit, well, not full. It has a lot of more extra space here. And I forgot to take all of my skincare with me. Um, <laughs> I'm not very good at skincare, I always forget about it, but I still have a cleanser and a moisturizer and they're in a small bottles too at home, so they would fit here perfectly and there will be still uh, empty space for something else. And also we forgot to take my husband's hair wax, but it would still fit here and still would be some more space because it's also in a small box. So what I have here, we have two deodorants, we have our toothbrushes, we have uh, toothpaste, and we have Agatha's toothpaste, <laughs> and we have my box uh, for like lenses, and we have this small set of shampoo, uh, shower gel, and Agatha's shampoo is in this small box. Uh, this is from the hotel that we used to stay in one time and write down if your spouse is the same or maybe you are the same. My husband takes all the these tiny bottles from every hotel that we stay in and I use them for trips also but if we don't have any of them at home I also have these reusable like refillable uh, bottles that I just add our shower gel and shampoo in them so it's everything that we have and it's more than enough for four days um, it just works perfectly for us and you know if we would go for a week or so uh, we would take approximately the same amount of clothes but we would not take all the diapers with us and we would still have a little bit more space for maybe putting like an extra pair of pants or just a couple more t-shirts you know but what i also wanted to mention is that we usually try to put uh the most like bulky big heavy clothes on us during the trip like for the road and not put it inside the backpack so for example if we would take jeans and a sweater with us uh i would probably go in jeans and in a sweater like during the road and other stuff that is more light and easy to uh, pack out pack you might not believe me that all of this would fit into this small backpack uh, because sometimes my friends just don't believe how much stuff is inside but uh, one thing that really helps me is that I roll quite tightly all the clothes that we have so what I mean is that I just take, for example, this t-shirt and I would roll it like tightly, you know, like that, into a little sausage and I would put them very like tightly inside the backpack so this way much more, like much more clothes fit inside so right now I'll put everything inside and into this uh, bag and I'll prove you that everything fits I pack 
packed everything. Uh, I still have a lot of space here, like if you can see. Uh, it's half empty, it has a lot of space to put uh, like a tripod, this stabilization thing, uh, snacks and other stuff. And we still have space here a little bit, but still like you can, you can use that, all that space to put some more diapers um, that we took with us, uh, but we used. Uh, and uh, to put maybe some extra clothes if you want to. So you also can use this uh, space, it's now empty, but you can use it. So thank you guys for watching, I hope it was interesting, informative, I hope it uh, could inspire some of you to pack lighter for your trips. Uh, also I hope that there were some interesting maybe tips that you can implement into your own way of packing. So yeah, thank you for watching, uh, I hope it was interesting and fun for you to watch and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye bye!